Okay, this is my ear stretching video, so we're just going to go ahead and start. So we're going to put you guys down. So this is pretty much just a video on ear care and how to you know, take care of your ears in general. So what I do is every day, at least once a day, at least, take your plugs out, tunnels, whatever you got in your ears, straws, I don't care, you grab a cup, you put, you know, a thin layer of sea salt in it, and you fill the rest of it up with hot water, but not boiling hot water, you know, it'll burn your hand and hurt, but an hot, you know, like shower hot, and you stir that, and it's nice and, you know, mixed up, then you get a rag or a clean bit of fabric, like a bit of towel or something, yeah, or something, and you dip it in the water, and you hold it on your ear, putting a little bit of pressure to just soak it in for two minutes on each ear if you've got both ears done, and that'll just help your lobes. And then what I use afterwards is um, vitamin E oil, and you just grab some of this, put it on your hands, massage it. India lobes for about two minutes as well as that. Um, yeah, and that will just help your lobes become thicker and healthier. And if you're going up in sizes, you know, if you're going to go up to like an inch and three quarters or something, that'll help you, you know, not feel as much pain if you're sensitive like that. But yeah, alcohol swabs are good. They're good for um when you buy your tapers and stuff. You're gonna just wanna. Grab your taper, wipe your alcohol swab on it, wipe it on your ear, and just push your taper through. I'm not going to do that because that's silly. But yeah, you, you do that, and then, yeah, that just helps to keep it, um, well, yeah, sterilized, even though you can't really sterilize, um, the, well, that acrylic, I think that's what it's made out of. Yeah, anyway, um... What I use for plugs and stuff, I'm only using these as temp because I only got this year done, you know, recently, and I've ordered more tunnels and stuff of my own. Um, they should be in tomorrow. I'll make a video of that and put it on here for you guys because you guys are gonna want to see that. Probably not, but still, I'm gonna let you see it. Um, I bought this 10 millimeter little wooden guy tunnel thing. Yeah for really cheap, like, what, in total postage and handling was five bucks for that little guy. He's, um, Sono wood, which is just a bit of wood. <laughs> um, it's good for your ears because these silicone stuff are good to wear once you're up to the size. Do not, please, do not stretch your ears with silicone because it can mess your ears up real bad. I don't know why. It might just be me, even though I didn't do it. <laughs> um, it might just be certain people, but it can mess your ears up bad. Um... Yeah, just wear it once you're up to that size is what I'd recommend. But if you want to stretch up with it, just do that. It's up to you though. But yeah, um, wearing the um, wooden stuff is really good for your ears because it's non-porous and it helps your ears stay healthy. But yeah, if you're going to stretch your ears, guys, you're going to want to clean them every day because, yeah, if you don't clean them, your ears are going to smell like ass and you're going to sit next to someone and they're going to go, what the fuck is that smell? And you're going to be like, I don't know. But you do know, it's your ears. So, recommendations is, if you're not going to stretch your ears, you're going to clean your ears. Because it comes in a package, guys. Yeah. Oh, that's about it. Just be safe with your stretching. Don't, don't skip sizes. We don't want blowouts and tears. Me being a hypocrite here, because I did that. <laughs> I learned from experience, guys. So come on. Yeah, but just be cool, take it slow, and have fun with it, because that's what the main thing is about. Alright, just, there's my little box of magic. <laughs> yeah, and, um, post, leave a comment, subscribe if you want, and, um, yeah, we'll, I'll post that video of me getting those tunnels next time, and I'll talk to you guys later.